Let's check back into the kitchen now with JR from JR's Old Packing House Cafe. He's there with Wendy today. Hey guys. Oh, I have to say, and JR has had a wonderful career too. He's got a better career at the restaurant than he does in his own home restaurant because his wife doesn't allow him to do the cooking there, is what I'm being no, told. No, this is I'm too messy. <laughs> This is too messy. So I've added a little bit of wine. I got the shrimp in there. Add a little bit of wine. Now we're going to add a little bit of pasta. And this is a, a dish that you can make so easily. I mean, it really is a Even fast. Even the husband can make it for the wives for oh, Mother's Day. Oh, perfect. Mother's Day is coming up. Perfect. So this is easy stuff. So this is a pasta dish that you've made. And you've already started to cook the shrimp that you put in here. You've yeah, got some look vegetables at these that you, go, you put go in. Go next door to Detweiler's and you get these shrimp. They're perfect. amazing. Yes. Oh, that's gorgeous. And you put a little bit of cream, I noticed. A little bit of cream. Just we're going to add a little bit. bit of pasta. Okay. And I like making kind of an Alfredo thing. Yes. So after I stir the pasta in, I'm going to add an egg yolk, and I'm going to add a whole bunch of cheese because, you know, cheese is like from cow, and it's like healthy for us. So <laughs> um, the more cheese, the better. I agree. However, you're not going <laughs> to However, if you're going to make it at home, don't add salt because you're going to have the shrimp's got, you know, careful right. with your salt. Okay. Yeah. And one of the things that you were saying is a dish like this is great, especially with kids, because you can add a lot of greens to it. Yes, I brought, sort of some, sneak it I brought in. some uh Fresh spinach, yeah. they're not going to notice. Right. Put a little parsley in there, they're not going to notice because right. you're gonna, they got the pasta, so they're happy. Right. And then eventually, well, as soon as we stir it here a little bit, but you know, whatever. So we're going to add a little egg, egg yolk in here, and it's going to get real rich and turn a little yellowy, and uh, it actually thicken it for us too. And this is this is a dish that you could make with chicken if you wanted to go the chicken Anything route. You, you could do you could do that easily, right? And some fresh grated parmesan. Nice. And again, that's. There's sodium in that, so you know, adding too much salt would be an issue. But, um, but I like it. So, yeah. and that's basically it. I brought, uh, and that'll thicken up real nice. So it's oh very quick. Quick dish to make, and any husband can make this. So it's easy. That is, that's always good to know. Any husband can make this. And I also want to point out, these are some of the other dishes that you make there at the restaurant as well. Oh yes, it? on Monday we have um, a Monday burger special, five dollar burgers. On um, we got nominated for Cuban for the state of Florida from the USA Today. For the state of Florida, that's yes. fabulous. U.S. Our Today. little hole, Rustin. Our, the little hole in the wall restaurant that I have. Wow. Yes, there's ten wow. restaurants up there. We're one of them. We're not on 41. We're not on the, on the key. We're yeah. We got we got nominated. That's excellent. Um, that is excellent. And that's for the Cubans. For the so Cubans. So please vote, is. by the way. Yes. Oh, fabulous. <laughs> Wonderful. And then these are. This is the dish that you're making yes. here now. And then this is a. Oh, picadillo. That's my favorite. Okay. You take rice and beans and ground beef and and you just make this yummy dish. And then you can do all kinds of stuff with it. You can stuff. Uh, you can make picadillo, you can make burritos, you can make whatever you want with it, and that's your base dish. Isn't that fabulous? Oh, that is fabulous. My, my favorite is nice? the plantanos over there. I just love yes, those. That's just they're nice too. and sweet, and yes. uh, they come from a plant, so they're healthy for you. Exactly right. And uh, we all, oh, Taco Tuesday. Oh, okay. So that's the same same meat, and instead of rice, because we're cutting back on our calories and our carbs, we're going to use uh, romaine lettuce, but we did fry the uh, shell there for you. Um, but it's a healthy shell somehow. I don't know why. I'm sure it's healthy somehow. And um, a very nice mixture of flavors and stuff, fresh tomatoes, onions. And, and you know what I've discovered? If you just take a bite of something, you don't have to eat the whole thing. Just eat, take really? a bite of something and you're fine. Who's going to leave the rest you of the pizza? You can go onto the website and look under the dishes section, and you'll be able to find how to make this dish. And, of course, don't forget that you can always go to Old Packing House Cafe, and you can find anything that you like and enjoy it. And we'll be right back.